But we are very excited to have our special guest with us uh, right now, our brand new mime correspondent. That's right, it's Patrick Collins. Ah, yes, hello, Pat. Hello, <laughs> thank you so much for coming in with our, our, being a brand new mime correspondent. Now, we'd like to ask you straight away, can you tell us, or actually, can you show us what it's like to be a mime correspondent? Absolutely, boys. And first of all, thank you so much for having me here today. Being a mime correspondent really is a job that I have undertaken thoroughly, confidently, and with the utmost gusto that you should expect from a modern day mime correspondent. Okay, thank, thanks, uh, thanks, uh, Pat. There, um, I was, I was, I just wanted you to ask you another question, just about sometimes as as a mime, you get, uh, you get pigeonholed, you get mm -hmm. sort of put in a box as a mime. You know, that's the only roles you can get. I wonder if uh, that's how you feel sometimes. Absolutely, that is certainly a relatable analogy that you've just laid out there, Eden. Um, uh, you can find that being a mime can uh, restrict you. You can find yourself placed within, uh, uh, how would I describe it? Um, uh, Yes, walls, or like a box, if you will. I think I would find that to be an accurate statement you have okay, mentioned. Okay, great. Josh? Uh, well, Pat, obviously, you know, being in amongst those other journalists, it's obviously a bit of push and pull uh, to get those stories off them. A bit of, bit of a tug of war, isn't it, to try and get those stories off the other journalists? Oh, absolutely. I remember uh, just this afternoon, a uh, Tennessee man was exonerated from jail for a uh, after 15 years that he spent in jail for a crime that he did not uh, commit. And... Uh, I broke the story, and uh, that's that's great. Yeah. Um, okay. Well, look, yep. speaking, speaking with the US, I guess um, maybe could you tell us, obviously, yeah, what's going on with the US election? Do you think Trump's going to concede anytime soon? Look, uh, I tell you what, Trump's really putting up walls, boys. Oh! He's really putting up some walls. <laughs> 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 he no idea what he's up to. <laughs> would he pull on a rope, boys? I don't think he would. Oh, okay, oh. <laughs> that's, that's fair enough, Pat. That is fair enough.